Hello YouTube, I'm David with the David West channel. Today I wanna to show you three progressively better ways to solar ignite leaves. Take a look right here. We'll start off with the slowest way, but still it's a good way. Just the wallet for now lens with some leaves packed into my hand. Take about two minutes to build up enough ember to where I could blow it into a big ember possibly put it on top of the leaves and then blow those into flames. A better way to do it though, with a weaker magnifier, would be these glasses with ashed leaves. That'll be easier, that'll be quicker. And of course, the quickest way of all will be with the page magnifier. I paid $15 for this at Staples. Let's get started. Always wear your shades when doing solar experiments. This one you've seen on my channel probably more than 10 times. Compact it down into your fist. And it does have to be compacted so that that heat will transfer deeper and deeper, which is what you're trying to do. Build as big of an ember and as intense of an ember as you can. Because if you don't give it, if you don't give it sort of two minutes to create a nice strong ember, you start blowing on it and it'll just It'll just go out and you'll have to start all over again. So, take your time with this. You will not burn your hand because these leaves will insulate the heat from getting to your hand. This is a good exercise to try to get over your fear of fire. But, uh, You'll never be a great fire maker until you get over that fear of fire. Continue to respect it, but do not fear it. You have to square these magnifiers to the sun in three different dimensions. Back and forth, left and right, up and down. So that's, that's what most people are failing at when they try to do solar ignition. They are not holding the magnifier square to the sun in three different planes, in three different dimensions. And the best way to get good at that is to practice. Some people say, I don't have that kind of patience to sit there and have a focal point train on those leaves for two and three minutes. I have, I have uh, taken five minutes to get the right kind of amber to ignite leaves. But boy, I do. When you think of all the physical labor it takes to do it, like a, a bow drill, especially a hand drill, which you're not gonna find dry enough materials in nature to do a hand drill. This uh, two, three, five minutes to train a focal point on leaves is like, like very easy. Now I guess that's been about a minute. 
and looks like we have a good hot ember but let's let's keep it on there a little bit longer especially now that the wind is blowing favorably the wind is blowing on it The nice thing about the next one we're gonna do, which makes it better than this one, is whenever you put ashes on any tinder, it turns it into a coal extender. So I can go down in power on my magnifier because I'm using my reading glasses, but I just have to get it started. And since it's a coal extender, it'll take off on its own. That's definitely been about two minutes. Let's see if we could turn this into a big ember and ultimately flames. Leaves straight off the ground, you know they're going to have some moisture in them. Let's see if the wind can keep that going now. We'll put some more on it. We'll start off with that much. You might be wondering why I am pouring off some of those leaves that are just sitting on top. Because you need that compaction for the reasons we've already talked about. These are three power reading glasses.
And our last one right here, we'll fill it up real well because most of you have already seen this technique. You know it's only gonna take seconds for this big page magnifier. Think of all the photons, photons coming down through the front of this and how big and how hot the, the focal point will be on this one. All right, y'all, do me a favor. Before you leave my channel, please subscribe, hit the notification bell, and in that drop-down list, select all. And do give the video a like. I appreciate you joining me on this one. We'll catch you on the next one. Ridges towards the sun.